Okay, so uh, this is me attempting to take apart the 106 to re-solder, uh, actually to remove the resin from chip 4 and re-solder it back in. Yeah. So here's me uh, taking out the fourth chip. This is the motherboard. This is one, two, three, four. Um, using the soldering iron and the wick. Uh, one, two, three, making double sure here. I got the right um, chip port and heating up the wick to try and grab the solder out of each port. It's quite tricky actually. Uh, there's some. Got the got most of it already off of the off of the board, but it looks like the last parts are the hardest to get and that sucker is quite hot. Sucker gets quite hot on the hands. You can see the solder there sucking up onto the wick. Trying to get most of it off. Most of it. Drain it. Okay, last little bit here. Quite addicted to the smell. <laughs> Tricky, actually. Okay. Now, let's see if we can push this guy in back out of here. Oh shit! Don't want to do that. Don't want to break the. Careful not to step on my tether. Tricky one right here. Yeah, this one's being a little bit tricky. It's not, uh, behaving itself. What helps this tremendously to steady your hand is um, Hansen's pomegranate and tequila. Mm -hmm. um, diet Hansen's pomegranate. Diet Hansen's pomegranate and tequila works uh, quite well to give you the bravery and the nerve to be even putting a hot instrument near your vintage synthesizer uh, board. So uh, the chip has been removed. Um, it wasn't that difficult actually. Uh, it was just meticulous and you have to be very careful not to break the pins. Uh, but now as you can see I have it in acetone uh, in a glass uh, sealed in a tub and uh, outside. So we shall see in 48 hours. I'm going to give it 48 uh, what the resin looks like.
So there are the four uh, soldering, my first four real re-soldering uh, welds, if that's what you call them. And uh, I thought those were, were pretty good. I mean, they look uh, factory standard almost. You know, soldered this this piece back in, so I'm feeling pretty confident that I can get the chip back in uh, without any issues.